Nikki's first communion was in May of 2000, when she wore a very long white dress and a veil with fresh flowers on it, and she looked gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. We had our entire family there, and his side of the family and all of the relatives. And of course, some of her close friends from school were there, and we had a great big party afterwards just to celebrate, because it was something we both looked forward to for a very long time. For children, the transition into middle childhood marks a passage into a new phase of their cognitive development recognized by many religions and cultures. Some call it the age of reason, the age at which children are expected to determine right from wrong because their thinking abilities have matured enough to do so. Moral reasoning and concrete thinking are just two of the new cognitive abilities that emerge in children during the school years. During the early part of middle childhood, brain development makes possible a host of new cognitive skills that spur children on toward greater independence. School-age children begin to use thought processes that are more sophisticated, more logical, and more based in reality. They use more complex language, and they become more aware of their own thinking processes. They also become capable of moral reasoning, it is no accident that this is when a child's formal education begins, not only in North America, but around the world. You find that around five and six and seven years old, the children are expected to give up their carefree, playful ways and take part in their, in their society. And we are, in fact, doing that in our very elaborate, formalized way when we begin kindergarten. We're saying it's time for you to learn to write your name with pencil and paper and add and subtract. These are the survival skills of our, of our society. I usually convince my mom by doing something. I usually go through my room, write down some questions. Mom, I have a question to ask you. It's just a question. Um, and I instantly know it's usually to see why I've made a certain decision, what it's all about. And she'll start asking, well, if you won't let me do that, 